Hello, and welcome to our first video for Spyro the Dragon. I picked up the trilogy this morning because it's been on my wish list since it came out, and this is a game I played a lot as a kid because it was one of the first PlayStation games I owned. And coincidentally, the name of the, t the title of the game is like nearly my dad's name, funny enough. Um, so we always used to make fun of him a lot and kind of joke that his name got pronounced like the title of the uh, of the game, even though it wasn't technically how it was pronounced. But um, yeah, so today we're going to start off the first game. Uh, I did I changed the settings already. The game supports 2K, which is good. Uh, I had to like tab out into the game to get the black bars off the side, but that that played out nicely. And yeah, I I was on the fence about this one for a little while because I heard that there was like a like there's a bug that will sometimes corrupt your save file, so we'll probably sim link our save file. Well, I think it has Steam Cloud, so maybe we'll set up like a scheduled task or something to back up the save file to another directory or something like that, or make versioning. Um, either way, kind of excited to play this one again, since I've been sitting on it until I really have the desire to do so, because I still remember, <laughs> I still remember bits and pieces of this game, so like it won't be a blind playthrough. I, mean, I haven't played this game since it came out, you know, like within a year or so that it came out way back when. Actually, when did Spyro the Dragon originally come out? Let's see. Was it 1998? Oh my God, over 20 years ago. Oh man, what a trip. That's how you know you're getting old, I guess. I, I, I don't know. <laughs> so yeah, it's been about 20 years since I played this game, so it's kind of fun. It'll be like Mega Man Legends, where it's just like, oh, I remember this part, oh, I remember that. So I remember a lot of Mega Man Legends, because I you know, played it a little bit more often. So, yeah, our goal is going to be, or what I want to do in this game, is I want to clear... First off, it's going to be a patience test. I don't have the patience I had when I was a kid. Like, the little, like, obstacle course levels where you had to fly around and, like, do four different objectives all in the same run without running out of time. Yeah, don't know if... We're going to try really hard to get those. But I want to try 100%ing this game. I don't often do that. Because I think it's, um... It sucks the fun out of games to, put, to try too hard. And as usual, there's a dog here stuck in my mouth somewhere, I think. Hmm. Anyways... Also, I hope Bear doesn't go crazy. Like, the minute I put my headphones on earlier to test things, he was, like, all hyped up, put his chin on the chair, was, like, looking straight at me, wagging his tail, and I was like, oh, God, here we go. So I played with them ahead of time. He should be a little bit tired. Even all he kept doing was bringing the toy I was throwing to the ice machine on the fridge, as, like, demanding ice cubes. Oh, no, there he goes. <laughs> Bear, come here, boy. Come on. So we'll see how Bear acts. I don't think, like, if you ever see me record a playthrough or, like, a game and you don't hear Bear barking, it's probably either an intruder or he's been kidnapped. So, just one of the two. Calm down, boy, please. We're going to use, like, a PlayStation controller for this to see how well it works, just to stay, you know, true to how the game went. And, um, I do have the game muted right now because it doesn't, uh, it doesn't mute when you're tapped out. So I want to be able to hear myself think. So, yeah, let's go ahead and turn on the audio, and probably adjust a little bit, that's really loud. Oh, it's probably more loud for me than it is you. Oh, you can't adjust the audio. <laughs> you know what, that's fine. As long as you can hear my voice over the audio, which I think you can. Anyway, it says continue, because... I, um, I made a save slot, just to, like, see how the game would play out. I haven't started the game yet. But, yeah, I mean, if you're in this, you'll be able to see one of the games we grew up with. Um, also kind of funny, too, because, like, I Min mean, and I just watched, uh, The Raya and the Last Dragon you know, last night, so I was like, oh my god. How, how fitting. Um, <laughs> right, here we go. Did I just unplug my controller? I did. Oh my god. Okay, rolling. Uh, oh, uh, it's been peaceful hey. here. Hey, Judy, how are you? Or is it six? We're doing something without guns or this time. Age. 
We now have 12,000 treasure. Or is it 14,000? What about this Ganasty Ganog character? Now, I understand he's found a magic spell to turn gems into warriors for his cause. <laughs> you suck at these games you're gonna watch? I suck at these games too. I never 100 percent of this game as a kid. Oh no. Imagination rhymes with devastation. <laughs> <laughs> you never finished the game either. Yeah. We rented the second one, almost beat it, and then never did. Oh my god. Looks like I've got some things to do. Hmm. Old TV. The animation is so good. Yeah, everything about this game is great. Frozen? No, all the dragons have been stoned. Yeah. Here we are! Wow, look at the graphics! I feel- <laughs> So does this not remind you of, like, what the games probably looked like when you were a kid? Like, this makes me think of what they probably looked like to me when I grew when I first got it back in 98. Hey PC, how are ya? Moonshield, yeah. We need Dr. Stone? I mean, we are Dr. Stone, except we're, you know, we're the, uh, the muscular kid that was with him. Alright, so that's the dash. Oh yeah, you can look. Pantherpaws1021, thank you for the follow. You have this game too on the PS4? Oh, hell yeah. Oh, there's the fire breath. Take that, grass. Oh yeah, we're a dragon. We're immune to fire damage. <laughs> This is gorgeous. This game came out like two years ago, too. It was born. <laughs> Gross goes back like it's nothing. Oh, look at it! You can roll? Oh my god, it's like a, it's a Souls like. So, two buttons do the fire breath. So O does it, and then R2 does it. That's kinda neat. Why does it think in our backyard? I wish the grass in our backyard would grow better. Alright, let's revive Nestor. So yeah, this game is all about gaining treasure, gaining eggs, and rescuing dragons. Thank you for releasing me, Spyro. Free ten dragons in the artisan world, then find the balloonist. He'll transport you to the next world. Mm -hmm. What about nasty? Norm? You can. I think you just head by too. Him. Find dragons first. That's all I can tell you. So yeah, you you. Oh my God! What? Oh, is it a tutorial? What? What do you do? Huh? Can I? <laughs> this is gonna be upset. Oh, it's a save point. Hi, Spyro. Oh, that's right. Hi, Wait, Spyro. how do I save? Maybe I have to do it later. Ooh. So yeah, here we go. We have four. So right now we're in the overworld. And there's going to be a hundred gems and four dragons. I know. Let's, uh... So what? So the health system in this game is the dragonfly. So right now he's gold. But if he gets hit, he's going to change colors. And if you, if you get hit, I'm sorry. If you get hit again, you change colors again. If you get hit again, I believe, you lose him for until you get him back. And then, um, you die if you get hit again. Auto save and running. Uh. And you can fly! Wow, look at the fly emote! Oh yeah, he picks up loot. <laughs> look at it! Oh, so you do have to headbutt it. Or run into it. Time, to Time to remaster, remaster. No auto looting. So the bug auto loots. I forgot the name of the firefly. On Spyro, you have much to learn first. Do you know what the dragonfly follows? The dragon want to skip it or see? Uh... His name is Sparks. Sparks, yeah. And protecting you. <laughs> there we go. Keep an eye on him and see what I mean. Yeah. So Sparks is your health bar. 
Alright, so this is a level. You have to jump on these in order, I think. The camera's a little touchy, but we'll make do with it right now. Got him! Oh, I couldn't move. Okay, so... Ah. Left click brings the camera closer far. Oh, that's not the right button. So enemies drop money the first time you kill them. I remember that. And that's health. Cheaper health, right? <laughs> oh, look at it. Spider's been at this how long? He's still stuff to learn. Oh my god, Draper Drag, it's cool. I definitely feel like he's a- he's definitely a dropout. Okay, I keep pressing triangle to breath. I don't know if that's what it used to be way back when, or if I'm just, like, really dumb. What does triangle do in any other game I'm playing right now? So yeah, the, this game has an overworld. So that's what we're in right now. We're in the first, like, zone, or first overworld hub. So this will take me to the first level. Stone Hill. We're not gonna go there yet. In 100% this game, you gotta get every single gem and dragon. And the eggs, once we find the egg thieves. So let's see. Neat. Uh, there we go. L2 is the turnaround. Ah, L2 makes your camera change a lot. Skill point acquired? What the hell is that? What? I don't remember our skill points. Oh, cool. Ah, uh, they're like, um... Hmm, I don't know. I think there's a... Yeah, there's an egg thief in here, right? Oh no, it's just this guy. Oh, an extra life! Can we order for need to grab lunch and joy? Aha. Uh -huh. Oops. Oh, I turned off motion blur, so let me know if this makes anybody sick. Oh, did she just make me save? Cool. Can you say a tip? Yeah, go for it. I played this game uh, like 20 years ago, so it's fine. Flash. Do, that again. Do they have two the players? They don't. A in the game Dragon looks cute. Mouth. It's a good game. But you are not yet ready, Spyro. First, you must complete one of the other artisan lands. You can come sit down and play it with me if you want, man. Waterfall, all platform. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, tell me. That's the boss room, I'm pretty sure, the boss level. Yeah, so there's a sh the, the, the level you open up here. Hmm. Yeah, Sunny Flight. So th there's one of these levels in every, uh, every area. I don't know if there's only one pattern that I got lucky or if you just have to touch all five of them. Thomas. Hey Spyro, press the jump button twice to glide. And and don't be afraid. Afraid of what? Heights. Falling from high mountain peaks, plummeting into prehistoric glaciers. Oh, that. Wow, it really made it better or cooler looking. I'm liking this a lot already. Alright, so we need 18 more gems and we can 100% the, the tutorial area of the game. I don't remember how to get up there.
Oh, it's in here. Yeah, he does this like little like flat thing where he like pancakes out and flat guides. Right, we don't want to go to town square yet. I love the like the sound and just the animation of you picking up him. It's so good. All right, let's guess that the last four are to our left this time. The controls are going to take a little bit to master, but there's not much to them, luckily, for a smooth brain like myself. Oh, there it is. 100% completion. You know what, we're already by Town Square, why don't we do it? So my goal is 100% this game. Ah, I like to do what I say, so we're really going to try hard to do this. big is this damn level? Also, this game is 38 gigs, which is pretty crazy considering, like, back in the day, this thing fit on a single DVD. <laughs> they really went, like, all out. No, they probably didn't compress anything. One number's a little bit hard. Oh, I know. I almost had it when I was a kid. But that was back before the internet, you know? Like, back in 98, like, we didn't even have the chance to look up guides. Welcome to Town Square, Spyro. I remember it. Begin exactly where the computer used to sit back then. Area with the bulls. Use the right stick to get a good look. Thank you, sir. Controller keeps unplug unplugging. Oh, we need to go get you. All right, so those are health. Let's leave them alone in case the bulls beat us. What? <laughs> I need to stop accidentally looking. Okay, the controller might have to get swapped because it keeps disconnecting. Ugh. Yeah, see? It just disconnected again. I'm telling you, they don't make them like they used to. Ah, interesting. Forgot about that. I'm gonna say I forgot about it a lot because I have forgotten most of this game. Okay, so that's just that. I love that you can roll. That's interesting. Alright, so to get up here... Uh... We probably have to go up here. Yeah? Yeah. Okay, why do I keep hitting triangle to shoot? I'm telling you, that had to have been the button back in the day. Probably not. Oh god. Del Devlin. Thanks, Spyro. Oh, look, Mickey. I have the worst itch on the tip of my Oh, knee. don't touch yourself Did with the you cooking implement. you know that you get implement? your longest glides by pressing the jump button at the very top of your jump? Thank you. You're there. All right, so you hear that little, like, guy making fun of us? That is an egg thief. So these guys will run from you in a set path, and you gotta chase them until you catch them. We'll be getting him soon enough, trust me. Right, that's nothing. 100% of this game is definitely gonna be really hard. But I wanna try, I really do. That's the end of this level, technically. If we wanted to leave. Spyro, 
Did you see a man dressed in blue running around all these delicious he's foods? A thief and he's stolen a dragon egg. You've got to track him down and, and get that egg. Run! Like he's got ketchup and mustard on his belt too. <laughs> oh, there's ketchup. A little wind in. Yeah, we don't want to turn, return home. Unless we get really stumped on a level, we're not doing that. Alright, so let's think about this for a moment. How do we get up there? It's not like that, let me tell you. We climb on this. We cannot. Okay, good to know. What's the point of this? Ah. Uh, Oh no, he tricked us. Wait, where is he now? What? Interesting. Okay, let's go get him. Oh my god, the controls are so tight. But we were already here, weren't we? Yeah. Oh, we just went backwards for a second. Okay. Can we run and shoot? No. So we gotta be really quick about getting him. Okay. We'll do our best. Oop. Can't take that wide of a turn. God, who makes these controllers? It gets connected. But let me tell you, it don't like to be. Yeah! Let's go get the gemly nest. Like the one out here, I think? Was the one like right here? Yep. Oh! Whoops. That might have been an extra life. Yeah. Huh! Rule of thumb, be careful with the uh, controls. He doesn't even have an egg anymore, like what's he running with? Oh right, he probably has an extra life now. Or nothing, damn. <laughs> oh, it was an orb towards an extra life, that's right. Damn, you straight up lose a life when you drown. Alright, let's go and finish this level. So we got like a top area we gotta do now. I can't get over how good this looks. It's so nice. Alright, so this is the area we were looking at earlier, right? And there we go. Oops. Okay. Now we just have to jump straight over here. Yeah. Oh, he was worth a 10? Damn. Thor! Thank you for releasing uh -oh. me, Spyro. Okay. You can always check your progress by accessing the guidebook through the pause menu. Thank you. Hmm. Oh, we have to blow on these, right? Yeah! One hundred percent level complete. Yeah, go me. 
Should I say go us? <sighs> this controller is about to become a. Um... Oh, great. And the other one won't work either. Damn. Uh, the PlayStation controller might become a flying object soon if it doesn't start working. <laughs> Did he wave at the camera? Well, let's see this idle animation again. Oh, he's waving at Spyro. <laughs> okay, that's kind of neat. Um, Alright, so let's go... Here. So enemies don't matter if you've killed them and we've already gotten their loot. They just give you like extra lives slowly. So let's see here. That's the next area. We don't want to do that yet. Let's go here. Let's go to this level. Dark Hollow. We'll do this. We'll do the stone area and then we'll do the flying level and then we'll do the boss. I think you have to get, I don't know if it's dragons, I think it's dragon, like, total, that unlock the bosses of the areas you're in. I don't remember. If I press X, he flaps his wings. <laughs> oh my god, look at this. The music. Guys with the iron shields, you have to headbutt them. Mm-hmm. Aha, uh -huh, we need a key. Ooh. 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 Oh, he's got to hit him once. Okay. I see. I wonder if you heat up the fire, if he'll heat up the meat. Get that butterfly, you crazy predator. It's scary, huge monster. That was really flat. Yeah, the game's got some pretty comical, like, violence. Light my fire achievement. I'm kind of curious if he'll cook the meat if I light the fire. Oh, hold on. Oh, wow, he gets you from anywhere. Okay. Interesting. Blue on that drum blow on the dumb truck, it'll cook it. Big enemies like this north with the club cannot be charged. Exactly. But a quick flame that should defeat them. I just need to be a little quicker. Yeah. Doesn't that meat look delicious? We'll get him in a second. Oh, we did it! Without getting hit, finally. Oh. But I was gonna say, like, um... From what I understand, dragonflies are, like, one of the most successful predators in the world. Or on the planet, I should say. Well, I guess it's the same thing. 65% success rate on what they hunt. It's kind of crazy. We definitely need extra lives because I'm terrible. Alright, so let's think what we ha what haven't we done? We haven't gotten this chest. We haven't killed him. We haven't gone down here. Oh, boy. Got him. Antipod, 1021. Hey, you're back. What's up, man? How you been? Oh, 
Oh crap. Wait, did I get him? Oh, I got him. You a big fan of Spyro as well? God, it's been so long. Alive for now? That's the important part. You're going through like um, some medical Spyro. stuff right now, right? Wanna know a secret? Use the action button when you wanna zoom in and look around. Oh, your secret's safe with me. <laughs> Is it something, is it medical stuff? Is like something you're just gonna need to get like a constant attention on forever? Or is it just something you're working through right now and you're just, just little by little work getting it, getting it resolved? Did we clear this area? Yeah, we did. Think. Both? Uh. So it's kind of like a permanent thing that you're always just going to have to keep taking care of, it sounds like. Let's hopefully things go well. I know you've been updating about it. Just hoping buttons are reject. Yeah. I'm hoping for the best for you. If things work out. Ooh, we got him! That's a strong channel. Sure if you'd escape those annoying little creatures. Of course they wouldn't bother me, but here's a hint. Their metal armor is fireproof, but a charge attack will take care of them. Good to know. That was the last one over for you. <laughs> Hopefully things work out, man. It seems like you're staying positive though, which I think is an important part. My gym partner stayed like very, I don't know, his, his, his outlook on things when he was sick was really interesting. Nothing really scared that guy though, but he was also old, so I mean, he was like 67. He had a very like, I don't care what happens attitude. Oh, we can shoot! You're positive, you're not positive. You care more about others than you do yourself just by doing three times on the table. Oh my god. But you're here. Well, you're doing the best with what you've got, right? Which is all we can, any of us can really do, which is good. I mean, you're taking, you know, you're taking the facts as they are. Like, no denial. No nothing. Something tells me this guy's gonna try to ram me. And fail. Okay. I remember this level very well. There's a guy you can chase around the top of the level. An egg, egg boy. Ram the ram. <laughs> Out ram. Boom! Hell yeah. The not so fun part about this game I remember is like finding that last gem that you missed and you cannot remember for the life of you where it was. Oh, missed him. It'll take me a while to get used to the controls. Mainly the camera. When you free a dragon or step on one of their platforms, you're saving your progress. Good. That could be useful if you run into trouble. Not that you ever run into trouble, Spyro. Never. It's only trouble if it's a threat to me. And we're one bad dragon. Don't think into that too hard. I still remember, like, this level. Pretty well. 
You know what? I'm gonna burn you. <laughs> yep. Yes, sir. After you've freed all the dragons, pass through this fancy vortex uh, thingamajigger. It'll take you back to the artisan home. But first, let oh, me he's gonna fall tell asleep, isn't you he? a story. No thanks. See ya! What? <laughs> a spiral. Wait a minute. Yes! I remembered! There's a secret. Hmm. Wait, let's make sure we got everything. Okay. Mm, I love it. This is how we get to the egg guy? No. I gotta go somewhere else for that. You can hear him now. <laughs> Won't get you all. Nope. Those guys are in the next couple areas, I think, too. Nope. Get out of here, Gandalf. Alright, let's make sure we clear this area. Looks like we have. Let's go up. Oh, hi. Gildas. Spyro, my friend. How about a hint on gliding? Yes, please. You bet. For the longest glide, press the jump button at the top of your jump. I know. And try pressing the action button to drop down mid-flight. I think the action button is, uh... That's triangle. Why would he tell me to press triangle for that? Oh, so I can just land flat. I see. Alright, let's chase the egg guy. Shall we? I'm pretty sure you just go into a circle. And you can just cut corners, or, you know, circles don't have corners, but you know what I mean. Because, like, he doesn't, see? He takes a long way around. Like, you're supposed to go like this. I remember that one really well. I don't remember if the eggs do anything other than progression, though. Okay, so that's the entrance. Oh, that well is a secret. We'll get to that in a minute. And that's a wall. We might be getting to that a little sooner than I thought. <laughs> Alright, yeah, I was gonna say, do we miss any money up here? Alright, let's go in the well. No! Never mind. I was trying to press triangle, but like holding X and pressing triangle is a kind of weird thing to do. Alright, let's see how many gemstones off we are. Probably 17. Gavin. Yo, there's my kind of dragon. Watch the dragonfly, Spyro. His color indicates his power. When he eats butterflies, he stays strong. Like me. That's my dragon uh, right there. Sure. Absolutely. So that's all dragons. So we're missing 17. Let's go find them. I think there's a way we haven't gone yet towards the end of it. So let's go do that. Oops. This is neat. The graphics are so good. Okay, so that's this. Yeah, we checked this room already. Let's go back upstairs. Oh, 
I wonder if there's another button that lets you stop in mid mid flight. I mean, I know you can hold X or square. My guess is something up here has the rest of the money. I mean, 17 is not a lot. I guess was right. <laughs> Is it here? Ah, uh, this game is really good at hiding stuff later. Ooh, look at that! We're down five. I don't think we can go any higher on this castle. Let's see. Ah. Uh. No. At least I don't think so. So if we're missing five... Oh, there they are. That's three. Alright, so let's go back up there. This is the thing I was mentioning. Like, you get a couple away and you're just like, crap, where are they? You spend more time trying to find, like, one than you do all of it. <laughs> Which is fine. All right, so let's keep our eyes peeled. Okay, uh, that's where we've already been. Yoink. All right, let's see. I don't think there are any more this specific way. Yeah, I think they're all just on the uh, side that goes around the, uh, the beginning of the level. Because I don't think we actually traversed that whole side. Like right here. Yeah, I think we skipped right up here. Yeah. Alright. We're probably missing a single green. That's my guess. Hmm. If I was one green gem, where would I be? Or two red gems. Back the way I came. Was it? Like this way? Spyro needs gem vision. It wasn't up here, was it? Like right here? Wow, it looks so good. So probably, is, I think it's on the top area, right? It's just like hiding somewhere over here. Oh, yeah. Dang it. <laughs> We did it! Thank you. <laughs> Alright, now... <laughs> Appreciate that. Alright, let's see here. That's 100% on that one. I saw a shiny thing I ran right past it. How did I miss that? It's like, uh... Alright, let's see here. Oh my god. The camera not following the direction you're dashing is super weird. Right, we don't want to do that yet. Yeah. We don't want to go to the next area yet. Not that I don't think we can, but... So... We have this level. I still don't know what skill points do. Unless they're just achievement points. There's 12,000 gems in this game. But the guy said 14,000 because I think there's an armory. Alright, let's do these. I, these ones are my dreaded, like, arch enemies. Because if I recall, you have to do everything at the same time. So these are pure flight levels, if I recall. Yeah. What? <laughs> if you press triangle, you just stop. <laughs> the more you know. You know what? Let's go this way first.
We might look up guides for these ones. But we'll see. I think this is probably the last one you want to do. Alright, let's hook left. Some of these have, like, really, really tight, like, timing. Like, you'll... If you, you have, like, a couple of seconds left before you fail. I remember that. Even if you did everything right. Because as you can see, our timing is not looking good already. What are you doing way out there, buddy? Oh, that's one I already got. Crap. Hi. What? Oh, no! Right, now we gotta do the trains. We're probably gonna fail this, but well, whatever. We're gonna try our best, right? Because that's all we can do. We did it! Ah, oh, that felt good. <laughs> Oh, man, that, that got my, like... Hey, Black, how are you? <laughs> I got my heart rate up. I get a lot of anxiety on, like, anything with a timer. I don't... I just... Timers and me just... We're not good. <sighs> Alright, let's see here. Does the game let you know that you have 100% an area? It doesn't. Interesting. Oof, gotta seize. But it won't come out. So I think this is the uh, airship. Up there we haven't been yet. I don't think we can get up. I thought you could get behind this castle, but no, you can't. because No, that's right. This is an empty room. You used to be able to see it through a specific camera angle where the wall would clip the camera. Oh, see ya. See ya, Pentapods. Take care. Bus time. Toasty. I remember this boss. I think. Is the next level a de desert, I think? I can't remember. I love the level transitions. I just comboed him. Oh! Noted. Duly. No! Ah! <laughs> Sorry, bear. Get away from the doggo for a second. Alright, first area done. And that's all death and blood. Why is there a blood, like, river down there, huh? Oh boy. Yeah. Gotcha. <laughs> I just noticed a hat lands on his butt when he dies.
I'd like some help, dang it. But we'll get there. I really like the cloud animations, like, they're so simple. Or textures, I guess, I don't know, whatever. Graphics. <laughs> Sparks is just like, man, I am. I have seen some shit. <laughs> I think he's coming down from a high. All the dragon pictures. That's really neat. Nevin. Nasty North. All right, artisan realm, Ars. Devious henchman. Reflection on the water's eyes. Nice. <laughs> Bring him on. They did really good touches. I think I smell a barbecue. Be careful, Spyro. Toasty has many tricks up his sleeve. What? Oh no. Oh. Oh boy. Can I get some health? We're probably gonna die in a second. And now we have to pick up gems ourselves. Damn. No, he got me! Oh my god. <sighs> oh, my controller. I wiggled my controller. <sighs> Alright, well, we easily have this now. We can't die again. Oh, unless we do that. Oh, controller's not working again. Controller is about to go flying. There we go. I have to get used to the spacings and timing and stuff. That's gonna take a little while. But we'll get there. But like I said, once we get used to it, easy boss. Do I like have to hot glue this one too? I get to the Xbox controller for their connector to say? What trash. <laughs> That is the entire first act of the game, though. Hell yeah, let's, do this. let's start the second one. At least I think it is. Give me an extra life. Yeah. You there. So I don't know how to tell, actually, this is everything in this, um... Ooh. Nice, you can just fast travel to him. Hey, welcome back, Panther. I'm trying to think if there's any more levels in this map. I think, I think we 100%ed it, the artisan world. Yeah, because we did this level. We did, uh... This level, we did the level over there. Let's do the boss. We've done the list level. Let's move on. Marco Blues. Good news and bad news. What happened? Busy rescuing dragons, Spyro. You may travel to the Peacekeeper's world if you like. Are you ready to go? Hell yeah. Hop on, Spyro. <gasps> Boom! Achievement. <clears throat> Game's giving us achievements for funny things. The news is I'm doing fantastic. Thank you. It is a bone protecting already. Uh oh. Does that mean you have to find another donor? Oh, what's like, what's the, what do I have to do for next steps? 
Titan. Welcome to That's Titan. Keepers. Look how our treasure has been stolen and turned against us. Please recover our treasures, Spyro. I just remember dragons like to collect treasure or hoard it. Hopefully, in the next three days. But what's that going to do for like the rejection? Like, wouldn't the rejection cause you to start getting sicker over those three days? Jesus. Do you have to stay in there like close medical attention or like how does that work? Also, ew, tar. And the level over there. Hmm. Yeah, it would definitely make sense to like go to the hospital, right? At least for a few weeks. That makes sense. Does it seem like Spyro is a bad guy when he goes and like torches people to death like that? Oh, so I remember the soundtrack very vividly. You have to like very lightly tap L2. No. Oh. Ah. Oh. Sounds like you have short and full of rage. What about this one? Hey, Pyro, Sparks the Dragonfly has been doing a good job protecting you. Make sure to keep him strong by feeding him lots of butterflies. Oh my god. Alright, there's a level down there. Ice Cage! Yes, I remember this level! Ice Cavern! Yeah, that was, a, that was one big dragon. Very thick. Cliff Town, huh? I remember one of the levels here being really hard for me to figure out how to 100%. Chunky. <laughs> Dragon Chunk. Wait. Oh, I was like, give me your gem. Show me your butt. Do it. You don't even have to touch the gem that comes out of it. You just have to, like, jump in while the gem is up. Oh, my. What? Okay. Wait, can I, can I try your child? No. Alright, so let's try to 100% the overworld. Dr. Shemp, I think, is the second boss. Don't ever charm me or my child ever again. <laughs> oh, I can't open this. Hmm. Oh! Right, be smarter than the game. <laughs> That's what I was thinking too. Ah! I almost ran right off that cliff. Don't don't judge me. So we have 120. Oh, we missed some stuff by the entrance of the of the of it. Okay. Let's go back. <clears throat> Judging went out in a bad way. <laughs> Perfect ten. Oh wait, this isn't the entrance. Ooh, how do we get up there? I'm drawing a blank, let's see here. We'll probably do these levels in the order that they appear on the, on the from the entrance so that we don't forget which ones we've already done. Hmm. Okay, there's a middle area there. Hmm. 
Oh. Yeah. Bunnies. Delicious sustenance from my dragonfly. There we go. Uh, how do we get to that from this side? Do we? That seems like too much of a jump. Hmm. Go back sounds good. Oh my god, we made it. I hate that the action button to, like, stop a glide is triangle. Oh yeah, I forgot we could roll! Hey, what, what trickery is he gonna do? Wow. Gonna well done, Spyro. Keep up the good work and I know you'll fulfill your destiny. Destiny? I just want to kick some. Just toast those enemies and collect the treasure. Kick some tail. Alright, how do we do this? Oh! He got me! Okay, can't do that. Kick ass and chew bubble gum. No! Oh my god. Alright, I'm gonna go get a bunny rabbit, because I'm apparently terrible at going in circles. Yummy. Get that rabbit. Alright, let's play this a little bit more carefully, shall we? <laughs> like that. <laughs> Um, and yeah, we got all the dragons in this area. <laughs> right, right. There's that area. I swear I saw... Oh, that was that. What? Okay. I guess we'll try to be a little bit more careful with our jump. A little much on the precision requirement, but we'll, we'll see what we can do. Wow. The closeness at which that jump had to work. Get out of here with that. But you can see what I mean, like, like I mentioned before, like, some things in this game are a little bit on the, like, too precise side. <laughs> ah. Point. 200 out of 200. Now, I feel like this level was designed to do this, but yeah, so now we're back at the entrance, right? So we could just go counterclockwise, hit this level first, then go to that level, then go to the ice caverns. Let's go to Dry Canyon. And we'll save the um, flying level for last, night flight. Those are hard to do. Took the back thing off my chair because I got tired of it. Now I want it back. Ooh, a ten. Let's look around. What do we got here? We've got a guy with a shield. And a musket, huh? Okay. Oop. So we're gonna have to learn how all these enemies work. Hmm. Weird. I think somebody's gonna shoot at us in a second. Yeah, see. Oh, 
And there's another egg thief. We'll worry about him later. Mainly because egg thieves usually put you in danger while you're chasing them. Oh, I guess we've already found his, uh... His, his, um... Route. Damn. Okay, well... We know what to do. He's gonna cut one of the corners to try making us fall in, or we hit the cactus. But other than that, we can, um, undercut him pretty good. Okay, well, we undercut him a little heavily. Go. Discussing options. Ah. Pasta check, that's right. Sorry, I missed that. But I guess we are pasta checking ourselves. Double pasta check. Oh. Point. Oh. Oh, give me your weapon! Thank you for releasing me, Spyro. Wow. You're welcome. So how do we get to that? Cat ship cactus is a must right now, or dragon ship. Well, that'd be cool. Tons of cactuses where I'm at. Ah! Okay, I, I had a feeling I wasn't going to be able to make that, so I stopped. No, I'm good. All right, let's go try to make that again. All right, let's see. Can we just make it from here? Yeah, okay. I'm done. Point. All right, now we're up in this little side area, and then we'll come back down and do that and wrap up. Probably the level. Right, let's double check for lootses. No. I tried. No. Oh, these guys all have shields. Boom. Oh, this actually might have been the right area. Yeah, I think this is the right way to go. Let's go back and, uh, and double check. Speaking of cactus, I have a neighbor if I walk the dogs around the uh, around the neighborhood. And their entire front yard is like overfilled with cactus. Which kind of sucks, of course, because um, I have to be careful. So the dogs don't run into them. Granted, if I or the dogs ever hit their cactus and get her, I'm going to come back with a machete and get rid of them. Boris. Oh, right put that rope down, buddy. Rewards good gliders. You are a good glider, eh, Spyro? I was born to glide. <laughs> I was born to glide. Oh, I was like, where am I? Oh, so it wants us to glide over there. Hey, you. What? I was pressing- Oh, the controller died. Oh, boy. Just look at it now. This might be this controller's last uh, last day in, in, uh, in all the pieces that it was assembled to be in. Oh. Ah! Controller final boss. Controllers are gonna be treated like a tutorial boss. Nothing irritates me more than stuff that doesn't work as intended. Especially made by these greedy ass console companies. I could just make something work. But hey, if it breaks and you have to buy another one, recurring revenue stream. If they never broke, would make a lot of money on them. Let's go here. So this will take us back to the other area, which will take us up to the area above the end of the level, and we get the rest of the gems. And a great example, I just had a dishwasher die on me after like five or six years of ownership. Dishwasher is supposed to last a lot longer than that. But if every dishwasher lasted, you know, 10 to 20 years, 
These poor companies, how would they, um, how would they hit a higher profit margin than the year prior? Ooh, that's the glide. Ooh, that's gonna be tough. Where's all the rabbits at, by the way? Like, I'm hunting rabbit. I don't see any. Ivor. Ivor? Is that you, Spyro? Are you the young dragon? Alright, old man, put the bomb so down. About? Ever since you were a wee puff of smoke, we've known. Uh, you've known. Yeah. Uh, I forget. Wow. Wow! Dishwasher. Yeah. Oh! Alright, bird. Okay. Yeah, my dishwasher um, leaked through the center of the tub where the temperature sensor is and then fried its own circuitry. Cheapest dishwasher out right now is like 350 bucks. And the cheapest one that doesn't have like all negative reviews is like a thousand. Give or take. Oh, 500 bucks. Why is he green? Yeah, I'm uh, I'm in trouble. Dishwasher is you. <laughs> yeah, I, dishwashing sucks because like standing still for long periods of time with a straight back makes my back hurt. So men typically handles that duty, and I just do some of the, the cleaning yard responsibilities. And I try to help out with laundries and stuff, all the fun, the good things. Hmm. Oh, fireworks! Oh, yeah! I remember these. Oh! Crap. Where are all the wabbits? They're all at the entrance of the level. Alright, here we go. Look how tight that was. And we don't have a key. Crap. There is a dragon under us somewhere. I can hear it. Or maybe not. No. But there's gotta be a way to go from here. Oh, it's just right back here. Dry cannon. We're missing a dragon. We're missing 32 gems. Okay. This is one of the levels that threw me off when I was a kid. I remember now. Alright, there's that we have to get. Um... He's a little apologizing for bleeding. This is on the carpet, though. That's a real question. Hi. Everything is cleanable, though. I didn't see anything in that pillar. But yeah, here we are. The fun part. Let's go get our health back and then we'll look around for the key and the last dragon. I don't even see the final key. That's the crazy part. Hi. Hi. Get the butterfly! Now we want to listen for like this, the sounds the dragons make. Wait, did we ever go up to that area over here? I don't remember now. I think we did. But we'll go there again and see. Hi, lady. Actually, I don't think we did, did we? Yeah, we did.
Yeah, yeah, of course we did. It's kind of funny, it looks like you can almost reach the exit from here if you, like, flew that way. Hmm. I don't even know where it is. This is basically childhood me's problem all over again. Let's sit and think. They mentioned colliding being very important. There's clearly nothing in this room. This was just kind of a dead end with some chests, but did it have to be? See, it looks to me like there's something on the other edge of the cliff over there you can land on. But how would you get back, right? Like, there's... There's nothing leading back from there, and this game doesn't have teleporters. Hmm. Ah. Scared myself. If I was a key... Where would I be? I didn't even double tap X. I just like pressed it and then didn't let go hard enough and then just held on to it again instead of letting go and pressing it. I just had to make sure. Rain went to, from flatbacks, flapjacks to teleporters. <laughs> flapjacks. Pancakes? Hello, can I say hello? Have a great Sunday. Thanks, Sam, and you too, man. Hope you're having a good one. I feel like I just heard the dragon. Let's do two things. Oh, there it is, right there. Uh huh. Oh, I think I know what I have to do. Hear me out. Hover over that way. If only childhood me could see adult me now. Whoa, that's definitely a Maximus. Glide, Spyro. I like a pancake I burrito. Forever with those ugly vultures standing on my head. Those oh shit, this version looks amazing. Hey Blake, how are you? Tasty. I know, isn't this amazing well looking? With a pinch of salt. Yeah. My, 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 I think tonight what it'll end up being Panther is probably eggs and bacon again. That was always... I love it. You really should, Blake, dude. It's it's amazing. And it's got rolling, so it's basically Dark Souls without stamina. It's got all the charm that it once had. Dragon souls. <laughs> I mean, it's, it's technically we're a dragonborn. Yeah, I never hundred percent of this level as a kid. I'm glad I'm not. I've at least gained something in life. Eggs with cheese and potatoes, caramelized onions, peppers, and maple chipotle bacon. Oh my god, that sounds like something they offer at the um, breakfast joint I go to a lot down here called Black Bear Diner. It'll probably be a scrambled eggs with salt, pepper, and cheese with some pep onions in it. And then bacon and sausage. Remember chasing the first egg for like 20 minutes? Yeah. That was such a pain. Oh, well, I guess we're falling. One thing I definitely don't like is just how over tight the, uh, the jumping is. Or the gliding system. 
They could have made his like max jump a little bit higher just to make it so you didn't have to like perfectly jump at the and then time your height of your jump so well. But you know. They went for the old standard. Yeah, you really have to start gliding at the tip of your jump, otherwise that your glide will be for nothing. You won't make it. Which kinda sucks. You can make it a restaurant, but like you're stuck there. Yeah, they're probably giving you like bologna sandwiches or some cheesy like hundred dollar meals. That's what I don't understand. Like places like hospitals, like they they, they got like some real bad foods. Graham crackers and peanut butter. Ugh. Oh, that's not the right button. Oopsies. We're gonna waste all our lives here. <laughs> Whoops. God damn it. Now I have to. Now now the like the part of games like this that I don't like is setting in, which is repeating the same action until I get it right. I have lost that interest 100% growing up. <laughs> Kid me had so much more time. Alright. So don't press X and then square. Press X and then X. But at the very top of your jump. Ram apple juice. Ugh. The apple juice they serve always tastes like water. Like somebody rinsed off like a peeled apple and said, here's the juice. I think this game has like that kind of pointless like game over system like Mario had where it's like you have extra lives. And they, if you lose them all, they inconvenience you by making you start the level itself over again. Apple bath water. You're not wrong. Alright, we made it this time, I'm pretty sure. Yeah. Easy. Luckily, most games nowadays do a good checkpoint system where, like, if you die, you just start at the checkpoint repeatedly, endlessly. That's definitely a plus that most game developers have gotten. Instead of, like, this weird, like, life system, it's just like... Oh no, you've used up Spyro's or, or Mario's eight lives. Start this entire level over again. Mild inconvenience, take that. I'm so happy we actually finished this level 100% though. Oh my god. Get the warm apple juice out of this. Uh, apple juice gotta be cold. Point. Point. Yeah, take that. Show me your butt. Oh, okay. Or just die. Remember the swamp trees level being a slog up to 100%? Yes! I never 100%ed this whole game before, and I want to. Yeah! But getting all three of the games for like 17 bucks is so crazy. So let me see, we're going counterclockwise from the start. So we did that level over there. Now we're gonna be doing this level. Wait. Yeah. Yeah, we've done the Dry Canyon. Now we're gonna put that. You did it, man. I can't believe that. Yeah, because like, didn't when you you had that like uh, all the everything prior to the boss of the game to do the bonus place, or maybe the boss of the game area was the bonus place. Because I know at the start of the game, one of the dragons is like, there's either twelve thousand or fourteen thousand, and then your indicator shows twelve thousand, but you can get over a hundred percent achievement or progress progression in this game. Spyro, my, my boy. Land. Let's try a treasure chest that would make me look for you forever. I remember this level. That's death. How does she attack? Oh. Give me. Huh. Most of the big enemies, it's just like, light them on fire. I like that. If it's silver, headbutt it.
Get out of here. I kind of don't want to accidentally kill those guys because I want them for when I get messed up later. Also, something tells me if I jump into that pod, I'm going to take damage. So I'm not going to do that. Knock, knock, open up. You're going down, mister. And mister, too. Oh, there's an egg thief in this level. Interesting. We have, like, I was gonna say, like... How's a dragon supposed awesome. to flame metal armor anyway? Remember, Spyro, flame won't work on metal, but charging with your horns, that should do the trick. How about we get a big ass hammer? That should do the trick too. Right, let's chase this guy around. Let's go this way. We gotta make sure we don't catch the corners on this uh, house. That's kind of the trick of this one. I think for this guy, maybe you're supposed to just like dive down and catch him from the ceiling. I think that's what you're supposed to do. Because you can't really cut that many corners on this one to catch up to him. You can see what I mean? Like, there's really not that much corner catching going on. Oh, maybe we can't get no more food allowed today for you. Already? Damn. What? What? I mean, okay. <laughs> Boom. That's why I was trying not to hit those guys on accident when hitting the, uh, the big lady. Point. <laughs> we'll probably, we should probably extra life farm someday, huh? Also, what? Did I not eat that butterfly? Crap. There we go. You can get it, boy. Just ivy. Uh, no food. Oh, jeez. So if you get hungry, you just have to wait for the like it to slowly feed you through your blood. Okay, so food does, or those things do give you gems. I got it. And then, yeah, that area over there is gems. I remember, like, missing this for the longest time. I don't recall if Kid Me ever went to, like, 100% get levels on the first run through of them, though. Yeah, take that. Spent hours trying to 100%. Yeah. Well, because remember, like, when this game came out, the internet was like. There was really no internet. There was game. Game facts wasn't quite really out yet. Um. Oh, my lady, please turn around. Nobody wants to see that. What was the Holy Grail? Oh, dang it. I have links blocked. I'm sorry. Enzo! Oh no! Oh. Hey, what's on the other side of that river? Why don't you glide there and find out? Hmm. Thank you for the hint. Went downhill pretty hard. Was it Neo Seeker? She letting you know she's smexy? Ooh. She wanted to put me in that pot. I bet. Right, so that dragon will take us to the tops of the house. Oh, I missed the gem. We'll get it in a minute. Oh god, I was like, he's too- he's got the high ground. Can that one get to me? I bet it can. Yeah, so, just remember we need to get these three greens. This will probably be the last gems we need to get for this level. So 
sorry. We're getting our confidence, slowly. But surely. I wonder if there's a path behind this castle. I don't think there is. Alright, let's scour this area for... Yeah, see, we forgot this guy. Bird of a Feather Achievement. See, look at we missed something. Also, I think that the dragonfly or the butterflies actually revert back to the uh, lizards when you don't kill when you don't eat them, so that's a good sign. Marco, hey, Hola. You've reached the highest point in Clifftown. You can get to almost anywhere from here. If I were you, I'd use that whirlwind over there. Thank you. I was gonna shoot her. Boop. Oh, he gave us a way to get back up easier. Huh. Or is the world landing higher up? Butterfly lizards? Yeah. That's what it looks like, at least. Aha. Uh -huh. All right. You can, it's easy to press triangle because when you when you double tap X to glide, oh crap! Uh, wait, what? Okay, when you double tap X to glide, it's um, toggle, so you don't have to hold it. Good to know. Thank you. Music changed, did it? I think yeah, it got a little. Ambitious. Wow, I missed a lot. <laughs> oh, that's right. If you just keep jumping, you'll keep charging. Alright, so I'm gonna assume that there's 18 gems in that locked chest up there. Yeah, I'm just holding square and he just keeps charging, so that's kinda cool. Wait, I don't have the key. I thought I had the key. Is it actually at that castle? Let's go check. Oh god, I thought I was gonna die. Where do you take me? For some reason, I thought I picked up the key. Oh, dumb. That was me. I'm gonna guess it is maybe back here. Oh, it is, yeah. Okay. Go. A purple one. But no key. Interesting. The key eludes me more. Hmm. Could it be like, see, my assumption right now is the key is like up here, right? It doesn't look like it actually. Oh, wait, we can get up here. Never mind. Of course, it's not. I wonder if we could see it from any angle. But we're safe to guess that the key is probably somewhere that we can see from some point of view, maybe. It's not a guarantee, but... Uh...
Hmm. Where could that key be? Oh, it's not a key. I know exactly what it is now. Never mind. Can't get to it from here, but. What? We actually have to go up there? Okay. It's just. Yeah, it's the, it's the fireworks. Right here. We did it. I'm gonna guess this is 100%. Oh my god, we're missing something still. Wait, did I ever light these up? I did. Ooh. 390 out of 400. We're missing a yellow, I'm guessing? Damn, this is a tricky one. Ooh, yeah. My guess is we're missing yellow, but I'm not actually sure. We lit these. Looking for shinies across the map right now. I don't see any. Let's make sure we lit all these up. Because maybe we missed one. That's death. Oh, what? <laughs> okay. Wow. Sounds good. I can't believe I missed that. Two random chests, of course. Yeah. It's very easy to walk right past it, though. We're one sixth of the way through the base game at 100% rate. Yeah. So now we do ice caverns. What? They possess a power I can't even imagine. Alright, where was the ice cavern at? I think it was past the... the tar, right? Oh no, the ice cavern technically isn't the next level. So that's the boss. We don't want to do the boss yet. Kind of weird that that even opens up already. But maybe bosses are blocked by progression and 100%ing get you ahead of time. Or quite far ahead, you know what I mean? Maybe. Can I make that jump from here? Yes. Oop. Did we pass the ice caverns? I guess we did. That's the flight level. That is... I can't remember if that's an actual level or not. Let's go find out. If it is, we'll just do this and we'll come back. I hate how, how tight those jumps are. I really do. Alright, let's go back. Oh, I missed it. Point. It's like a decline down to the portal, so that's why I'm just forgetting exactly where it is. Uh, oh, it's right here. <laughs> Ice Cavern. So after this, we have the start. Dark Flight Quest, and we have Dr. Shemp. Dr. Shemp, I remember, it was like steps up, you know, to like fighting up, up an arena. This might be the last level we do for now, though, because I gotta check with him and make sure. And our schedules are working out together. 
Look at this level. Look at this idiot. Oh. Okay, that's actually pretty good. Cool. Damn, bro. Damn. Keep going. Jesus. Yeah, freaking welcome to the gun show. Am I right? Look at this. You could, like, it makes you think that you could probably fly to every part of this level all at once if you wanted to. Wow. It looks so good. Oh, I thought, I thought Spiral was, like, snoring. He was sneezing. Amazing graphic. Yeah, they did a really good job touching this up. I'm really, really impressed. The bats don't hurt me, right? Nope, they're to the health. Oops. Ulrich. Word of caution, little one. Wait until you grow big, <clears throat> like me, before charging those large enemies. Thank you. I had no idea. But now I do. Oh, did I get slowed down by this by the slush? Huh. Yeah, I was almost tempted to start a Terraria playthrough in, in lieu of this game, but I wasn't feeling quite ready to do that yet. Also, is that backwards or forwards? There are gems right there. Let's go back and get them. So I don't know. We'll, we'll, we will start Terraria eventually. I just don't know when I'm going to actually feel like that. That's a... That's a commitment. And a half. Ah. Oh. Hello. Is this the level you use to like farm level like what like extra lives? Because I figure you could. All right, look here. I figure you could probably just glide straight to the exit of this level. After hitting that, it isn't a trap, is there? Okay. Okay. Oh my god, this. It really does lead you straight to the end. We found the gem farming level. Thanks for freeing me, Spyro. And now. Being forgetful, apparently. Oh, this makes me nervous. Can't hit these guys with that breath, right? Okay. Oh, you just have to hit them off the edge, I see. You just remembered my- he remembered my name, right? What a nice guy. Come down, bat! Thank you. Woo! Bye! I see. Yeah, usually you're gonna take a hit trying to, like, figure out how some enemies work. That's just how it is. Hopefully it's not too jarring the way the camera gets moved around. Ah. I don't like ledges. Oh, uh, see? I almost, like, flew off the ledge. Triathlon achievement, huh? Interesting. We're doing a really bad job of, like, verifying that we're getting everything. Hey guys, stay alive for me for a little bit, in case I need you later. Hey yeah, hey yeah.
We missed the middle part of this level, so we gotta go back and do that. Ragnar! Yo! You've done well, Spyro. Some dragons thought you weren't ready, but I knew they were wrong. Thank you, guy I'm with red necklace. Right. I'm ready for what? Killing. I'm gonna cl I'm gonna ass assume that we've cleared that area, and let's just go we'll go back to the entrance around this way. Why not? Don't really matter. Okay, this isn't actual ice, thank God. Oh, look at that. We're gonna have to fly, fly down to that. Ooh. Dude, why is probably the only tiny dragon? Wonder if he'll grow into a full dragon. Just show her thoughts. Thank you for releasing yeah, it is kind of weird. Like, why is there only one child dragon? Welcome back, by the way. Maybe he's actually like the, the Peter Dinklage of dragons. How are we gonna line up the you? Get out of here. So we have we saw the key, but we haven't seen the chest it goes to. I'm gonna guess it's up here somewhere. Oh yeah, there's this whole central room, isn't there? Ah! <laughs> Damn it. Eh. Todor. Todor. Spyro, some big norks up ahead are wearing armor. And in the ice cave, armor can make their feet very Trogdor. <laughs> hmm. That was a kind of a dragon thing. Shape. Um, line up his uh, mohawk with the pole. So there's a key over here, but I think it's probably better to get it from up there than here. I feel like here we're not going to make it. Yeah. I wonder how how much time it's going to take to 100% this level. Don't 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 talk to me. I didn't miss. Is this where we left off earlier? I think it is. Yeah, it is. And I unplugged my controller again. God. Oh, man. That's so frustrating. Welcome back, Panther. Almost 100% on this level, I think. I think we just need this key. <laughs> There's the chest that the key provides the uh, access to. So let's look around too, right? We have a good vantage point of this level. I'm not seeing any more shinies, at least from this this view. Oh. Somehow I missed that. Oh, I know exactly how I did. Now, real question is, will this chest have all 30? Just having some fun, blood put in or and blood taken. So what's weird is like I can watch a needle going in my arm, that doesn't bother me. Like I can completely watch it, but for some reason and it didn't used to happen. Like watching blood come out of my arm will make me feel lightheaded, even though it doesn't bother me or anything. Like my brain just says, like, hey, you're gonna get woozy now, and I'm like, why? It's just blood. <laughs> I've let a lot of you out naturally. You can take tattoos, no problem. Yeah, tattoos seem fine. Just specifically blood being pulled out in that vial. I don't know why. Your husband kind of the same thing. Yeah, it's just weird. It's like you don't get the choice of your head getting light when you're looking at it. Even though, like, you're, you feel mentally fine, but your head just disagrees with you. It's stupid. He's fainted from the sight of blood? Oh my god. So, like, I can... If I'm bleeding like crazy, I'll just wipe it up and deal with it, but damn... 
The smallest comes finger. Oh. Emperor. <laughs> he popped over. <laughs> for me, it'll only happen if it's being drawn. Like, I just get lightheaded for some reason. Dull red leak detection fluid. His dad came and smacked him. Wake up, boy! What's wrong with you? Came to and said, well, that felt cool. <laughs> what? Also, I forgot where to go. <laughs> oh, right here. Getting IV and stabs not not difficult, but not great. Oh, I looked away. Oops. Um, luckily we got all those extra lights from this level. Weird. Yeah, I don't know what is up. Like, it's just like it's weird how things happen in life as you go, right? Boing. Look at that. Weak to gravity with like fly, right? And I like spiral to like not quite great dragon. So, funny thing, I'm pretty sure that makes it so we're only missing one level from this, uh, from this overworld hub. Oh, let's fry these guys. You first. Ah! Show me your butt! Or don't. <laughs> Hi, Spyro. <laughs> but yeah, so we did that. Let's take a look at our guidebook, right? Yeah, this level had a lot of level. This zone had four levels. And then the boss. Cheeky. <laughs> does this one... Does this one really only have three in the flying level? Interesting. Oh yeah, and there's also these skill points. I don't think we'll do all these. But apparently in Stone Hill there was a hidden pink tulip. And then all bowls stuck. Perfecting Dr. Shemp. I mean, I think that means killing him without getting hit, which would be easy. But ride a druid platform for 10 seconds on Blowhard. Yeah, Blowhard we're not anywhere near, so that's okay. That's the third boss, I think. Collect skill points, unlock parts one and two of the art gallery. Ah, that's what they're for. Butts, cheeky butts. I wish I knew how many are left. How many levels are left in here? But that's okay. So I guess the game just auto saves constantly, right? Yeah, good dragonfly. So. Yeah, I think the only two things left would be going to Dr. Shemp and then going to Nightfly, which is like in the center of the sacred center area. But we do have to pause for now. Because got some IRL things to do. Not many, but gotta eat, right? Let me see. Yeah, there is no... We're already 29% through the game. Oh my god, we've been in this game for an hour and a half. There's gonna be another Mega Man Legends. Just kidding. I'm pretty sure when she hits me, eat for you, please. I will. Oh, I used to eat in like the first five minutes of us sitting down to eat when we watch TV. It's kind of funny. Ignore the audio, that's the controller deciding that it um, doesn't want to work. It just reconnected again. So that was really fun. It definitely brings back some good childhood memories of this game specifically. <sighs> How old was I when this game came out? Yeah, so my parents were still together when this game came out, so that's interesting. Um, yeah, yeah, 2006, 7th grade? I don't remember, but... <laughs> Look at him taking the camera, he does do that! Oh, that's great. Oh, I read my shirt was milk. Oh yeah, it's muscle milk. It was a shirt my gym partner used to... Pretty much anything you see me wear on stream was a, like a gift from my gym partner. So, I just wear, like, all gym clothes all the day, all day, every day, because they're comfortable. Oh, this shirt's, like, almost as thick as cardboard. It's like wearing a Carhartt piece of clothing. Um, yeah, it's kind of interesting. Hmm. <laughs> he keeps taking the camera. But, we're gonna call it for now. And we'll be continuing this this week for sure. 
But I might go live again soon, an hour or two from now, maybe. Ooh. I'll check out. I don't know what I'm doing DRG today, um, but I'll definitely keep an eye on that. Really, Spyro? Thanks. You guys gonna do uh, drones again, Black? That was cool. It's it's so funny how they sound. I think it's just fall part. It's game accelerate. Yeah, it really does. Like I'm, I'm happy I finally picked this up off my wish list. <laughs> oh, <laughs> the little butt wiggle. And the sound effect too. Oh my god. Just drones? Oh yeah, man. I'll keep an eye out. Alright, let's see. I have to alt tab to get out of this. Alright, well, we're gonna call it for now, but we'll definitely be making progress throughout the week. And aside from like DRG, I think this is gonna be our main focus right now. Because I like to kind of keep my, my games on focus and I kind of limited. That way I, I keep the interest in them and finish them and don't ghost them or, you know, just, um, get rusty so I happen to Hades at least once appreciate you guys all stopping by to watch and uh, continue next time take care